So don't forget the principles that we find in the Constitution are found in the Bible itself. But what are people doing? They're attacking the Bible. They're attacking God. They're attacking Jesus. They want to remove the Ten Commandments from everywhere, take God out of everything, get rid of the Pledge of Allegiance, get rid of nationalism, but we were founded on Judeo-Christian principles. And what's happened in the UK and Europe where this foundation has been removed? When you remove that Judeo-Christian foundation, you get secularization. And then, of course, that constitution or the document that your country follows is then firmly planted in midair. And that leaves a vacuum for another basis, a new foundation to come in. And if the Quran ever became the new foundation for America, then the constitution would change. So make sure, whether you like it or not, whether you believe it or not, <laughs> remember that the Judeo-Christian worldview, the Bible, is what the constitution was based upon, and we need to keep it that way. Make sure the Constitution is not changed and the Bill of Rights are not changed. And remember what Ronald Reagan said, freedom is never more than one generation away from extinction. It must be fought for, protected, and handed on to our children to do the same. Or one day, we will spend our sunset years telling our children and our children's children what it was once like in the United States where men were free. And if that day ever comes, this is the American story we will tell them.